Hey guys, a few months ago I showed you guys how to fix your earphone if one side stops working. Well, later I realized that instead of fixing, we should try to avoid that situation. So in this video, I'll be showing you guys how you can stop your earphone from dying and you should follow the things that I say in this video and then you'll be able to use your earphone for a long time. And I've been using my earphone for about 7 months from now and I didn't have any issues. So without wasting any more time, let's just get right into the video. First of all, avoid cheap quality earphones. Well, not only they sound bad, they die really really quickly and they are not also good for your health. So in my opinion, if you are going to buy a earphone, your minimum budget should be around 5 to 10 dollars. And if you are going for a wireless one, then you should obviously go for 10 dollars minimum. Well, in this channel, you'll find some good quality earphones that I made review about and also some bad ones. I'll link the playlist in the description box below. So if you are going to buy a earphone, then you can obviously watch those videos. Now the second reason why I would say is the connector. Well, there are two types of connectors, one is I-shaped and another is L-shaped. You should try to avoid the I-shaped ones if your phone has the earphone port at the bottom. If the port is at the bottom then you might use it like this when you hold your phone and it will get extra pressure from your body which is bad of course so you should try to go for the L-shaped ones. And as the I-shaped ones actually break really quickly it's actually better to avoid those earphones. Another thing is branded and non-branded earphones. You should go for earphones that are actually from good brands because they will give you better hardware and you might get warranty from those companies which is really good and useful especially in stuffs like this and then you should also try to avoid non-branded cheap quality earphones because of course they don't have good hardware and they will die eventually. Avoid tangling cables. Well a huge issue of wired earphones is that the cables tend to tangle really easily if you don't hold them or use them properly. My best solution would be that you use a earphone case. You can get these types of earphone cases from really cheap price and some companies also give them for free. Or you can also use the scars and life height methods which I don't recommend but they also work really. Well it's almost 2020 now and the best solution right now is go to wireless earphones. Because in case of wireless earphones you won't have the issues that you will have on wired earphones. So you will get a lot of relief from issues like tangling cables or like the connectors that I said earlier. And wireless earphones are in general better than the wired ones in my opinion. And nowadays the wireless earphones have a really low latency and you can actually enjoy games with them also quite easily and nicely. Avoid using your earphone on various devices. Well not all devices are built equally. Some devices have good audio hardware and some don't and that makes a difference on the output of course so if you use your earphone on a like 500 dollar phone then use it on a 50 dollar phone obviously the sound quality will not be the same and the output will also not be the same so your earphone might have to adjust and that puts a pressure on your earphone hardware of course yes earphone hardware so try to avoid using your earphone on various devices and try to get different earphones for your different devices. It will be better and you might use them for a long time. Avoid going on to the maximum sound. Well, instead of using 100% of your sound, use like 80 to 90% or 70 to 80% because it will also be healthy for your ear and also be good for your earphone because it puts the extra pressure on the speakers of course. So try to avoid that maximum sound. So these are the ones that I could find to avoid the earphone breaking issue but if you have more and more solutions then obviously share it on the comment section below. It will not only help me but also other people. So this was it for today and I will catch you up in the next video and obviously please consider subscribing if you learned something from this video.